The 2007 Solheim, fun and excitement. One of the best weeks I've ever experienced out on tour and ever. There's only 12 girls that can represent the U.S. and to be one of those 12 was very special. We went there knowing it was a, a tough task, but one that we all believed we could achieve. As soon as we got there Monday, we acted as a team and we just had an amazing time. I think personally that I had a pretty good feeling going into the week just because of how 2007 has been the best year for for Americans on the LPGA Tour in a very long time. The team was such a great mix. It was completely different than any other Solheim Cup I played on with all the young ones. They have so much energy and I just think, oh my gosh, did I ever have that energy? And I don't know that I did. The ones that have been there and done it in the past, you know, it keep, keeps their fire burning too, you know, when we're excited and get motivated and, you know, hooping and hollering and stuff. So, you know, just everybody feeds off of everybody. The chemistry of the team was just uh, wonderful. And then the excitement of winning uh, on foreign soil for us was, uh, was, was a huge bonus. It was such a huge achievement. It's the first time in 11 years that we've been ever able to bring back the cup to American soil. She got it. It is over. Well, I'll tell you one of the neatest things was when I was home the week after, I was uh, watching some Golf Channel replays, the edited uh, versions, and so after they showed me making the putt to clinch it, they pan back to Paul and Betsy hugging up on 16 team. I thought that was a pretty neat scene. That's like our, our Olympics. Every athlete dreams of, you know, representing their country. And when you get the chance to do that, it's just, it's unbelievable. It's all about being a team. And when you can, you know, pull 12 players together, you know, you can be unstoppable.